and welcome to Let's Wine About It. And we have a first time awesome special guest who has been a big fan of the show, but I'll let him tell this. Um, but he is known as the C3 UC guy. Also, drum roll please, da -da 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 -da. Ryan Boyk. Welcome, Ryan. Hello, hey, thanks for having me. Yeah, I'm a longtime fan of the show. It's my first appearance, hopefully not the last. So uh, thanks for having me. I appreciate it. Look forward to talking to you. We've got the same gosh darn bottle. Yes, yeah, same bottle. Because you know why? Because we have Robo and spam callers gallivanting around the globe today. You're the one who had the biggest wine in a meeting I've ever heard, so I'm glad you can now share it with the whole world. So let's get started. What are we whining about with spam and robocalls today? And I apologize for going off last week on that, but man, I just get so tired of it. And, and hopefully we don't dwell on this for too long, but I can't even answer my cell phone anymore. Otherwise, it's a robocall or a spam call, and they're calling to say, did you know your account's been breached? Or did you know that you're wanted? Or did you know that you can get a COVID-19 shot sign up here? And um, oh, by the way, your car warranty expired. Can you sign up? Or you can renew your car warranty. Well, hello, I don't even have a car. <laughs> Backed up four wheel drive truck mother. Amen. <laughs> and, uh, and it's not just calls, it's text messages. I can show you screen after screen of robo text messages. Um, a lot of it was with the election. It has calmed down a little bit, but I'm still getting them. This little doodad here isn't much better than the cell phone anymore. My work phone, my desk phone. People call it, it's a sales call. It's a call for crap. I'm like, do I even answer it? Hello, hello, hello McFly. Is anybody there? You know what? I don't need this thing anymore either. So there. Um, there goes that phone, and you know what? I'm gonna throw the cell phone out too because it's just constantly going off. It's alert after alert after alert, and I'm like, what in the world? So let's say we're getting all these robo calls and spam calls. You know, what can we do to help one protect us, and then two even block these people calling us? I've signed up on that do not call list a couple times and I'm still getting them. So I don't know what the workaround is. I know that we're in the phone business, I guess you could say it too, the UC guy. So there is ways to block, but they keep pulling these numbers out of these random pools. So it's a random number. It's a random number. Taylor, you've won a prize. Please tell me it's free wine. Yeah, free wine. Okay. No. no. I will gladly accept free wine. <laughs> oh, and I'm starting to get pissed off again, so I'm glad the wine is here. The, the moral of the story is, I think I'm going cell phone free. You can call me on the desk phone. No, you can't actually, it's broken. Um, <laughs> email me, email me, write me a letter, or come on over and have a glass of wine. Well, as always, Ryan, I do, well, I shouldn't say as always, it is your first time, but I appreciate you so much joining us on Let's Wine About It. And until next time, everyone, all right, and if anybody wants to join me on the cell-free movement, let us know.